Gotta get payback! String them up! Yo, bro! Over here! Over here! Dude! I'm trapped! Thanks, bro! There's hope for you yet, T. You saw the devil. He's close. Don't let him get you.
remember the first time we met? We were in Druid Hill, and I saw you in that old, broken gazebo. <laughs> you were so good looking. Mm. I thought you were all mature. Oh, but sometimes, I think you only brought me suffering. Welcome, my fine gentlemen. I'm so glad you've come to see the show. My performance, uh, my performance on you, as it were, will be something I shall thoroughly enjoy. And I trust, so shall you. I am not certain we have been formally introduced. Talk, isn't it? Uh, my name is Killjoy, Dr. Killjoy, and I will be your alienist this fine evening. Welcome to the Carnate Institution for the Tragically Troubled, the Impossibly Insane, and the Diabolically Disturbed. Are you seeking asylum, Tor? Are you looking for the answers? Well, rest assured, you have come to the right place. <laughs> Mate, hold it right there. <laughs> Come back again, friend. Listen, I think it is you want to go to attic, da? The building it is old. You may need to go through a big stair room or somewhere to find way up there. Hatch may be hard to jump to. You probably need something to stand on. You try hard. You get there. 
He's a filthy immigrant. He's so friendly. You go so disgusting. You change like the company. And I willing to share what little I have, huh? Yeah? It is good to see you. You like the uh, second hand smoke in here? <laughs> it makes you feel good. And so, my favorite subject arrives. It is in this room that all the secrets will be revealed. I will employ an experimental device that helps me chart the undiscovered country. But you can't come to the show yet. First, you must prove to me that you truly want to be cured, and that you truly are worthy of my time. See you soon, I hope. Monsters walk amongst us, talk. Don't you curse the implications? It's a brave new world. Of course, such creatures are... Sometimes it is the body that threatens the safety of the mind. Sometimes it must be removed. How does it go? Oh yes. Canst thou minister to a mind diseased? Pluck from the memory a rooted sorrow. Raise out the written troubles of the brain, and with some sweet oblivious antidote, cleanse the stuffed bosom of that perilous stuff which weighs upon the heart. <laughs> my, my, if only it were that easy. <laughs> You'll have to forgive the mess. It's so hard to keep this place tidy when there is so much work to be done. And it is impossible to find decent help out here. Ah, but truly, this clutter doesn't even compare to the disorder inside your head, does it? That's where I do hope to do some spring cleaning. Severe dementia, is it? Or perhaps chronic melancholia? Or is it an uncontrollable urge to regress back to a form unseen in modern society? One that will allow you to set matters right in the most... I miss you a lot. When are we gonna see you again, Daddy?